Hello fellow Metal Shirt Collectors, uh, finally doing the next part, I think it's the 7th, I think I should start, uh, stop calling those numbers because I might not remember which one it is, but okay, without further ado, let's kick off, and the first one for this week is Satan's Strange on Mankind, Europe's number one satanic gore grind, terrorizing Christians come since 2005. Absolutely amazing. So you know what they play. And a nice back as well. Proper, proper, brutal stuff. Right, let's go to the next one. Uh, diminished. The next one is Diminished from Serid Records again. Uh, yeah, it is, yeah, quite worn. It's okay. There's not, nothing like mega special about it, but yeah, we got it somewhere, not too expensive, so yeah, why not, yeah, uh, then we move on to the Arson Project, if you're like fan of Nile and stuff, so you should, you should like the, these, I think, yeah, the next one is as well, the Arson Project, so I'll have two of them, uh, from first two albums, I think, so yeah, Forgotten uh, Graves is this one, yeah, nothing on the back, but nice black and white shirt and then the, the next one from them as well and again nothing on the back I think Disgust is the album yeah so I think this is the second one that one is the first one but I'm not 100% sure yeah if you are into bands like Nile check them out and, and fuck big and stuff you know so sh should like it uh, then the next one is, is actually a different color this time uh, some punks love grind, get over it. And that's from the band called Sinus, I think it's called. I think it's pronounced like that, yeah. Yeah, nice, really nice. And uh, moving forward to the next one, uh, we had a couple of them, and I mentioned them already. Fuck Pig. Really great band, really great. Highly underrated. They are, I'm not sure if they are so actually known outside uh, England they are guys from Birmingham but yeah as well nothing on the back on this one seen them once the, uh, the other previous one I mentioned today I've not seen those right then another one I've not seen of course is a Terrorizer well I shouldn't be saying of course because this is from the tour 2018 but yeah I've not seen them but I have a shirt. The next is a guy I have seen and I loved it and that's Vomitory. Yeah, Scandinavians but awesome, awesome, awesome the smell. And this one has a back print as well. So yeah, might be some more of them in this pile. Right, so everyone knows this one nice design and especially love the back if you know me already in because of the few previous videos oh god is that is right up my alley i love my blasphemy so yeah your oh god is that from morbid angel next one is separation nothing on the back on this one but a nice nice design i, I like them I've seen them live in, in I think in small club in Manchester but great yeah if I remember correctly then the next one is the rotted which is like they originally started as go rotted I think most of you know and uh, they changed the name when the last one of the founding members left so they tried to play slightly differently slightly more melodic I would say and uh, they choose the name, so I don't mind the, both of them, so yeah. And the great shirt, sadly nothing on the back again, but yeah, nice shirt and nice band. I had, I had one of shirts from this band before. It's a master. It's a weird, weird color, <laughs> it's like, like, I don't know, mustard. Yeah, 
Well, it's, it's again nothing on the back. Today is nothing on the back on these shirts. Well, yeah, master is master. Then we go to Dead Congregation. I've seen those guys, they were great. Again, nothing on the back of this one. I like I like this these kind of drawings, these these old old school type drawings. I don't know what, what art style is it called. But yeah. I don't know, Bible style. I like them. Right. Then we have next is Hate Eternal from European 2004 tour. Awesome album actually. Might be actually one of my favorite albums from them. It's really really good. But Hate Eternal is not for everyone. They are quite, quite brutal, quite dense death metal I would say. There's no time to get bored, you know, it's proper everything happening, you know, so. Right, and another Altars of Madness. So as I said, I had last time already one and then it's, yeah, it's a bit yeah, and good. This one is 10 years of madness, so it's quite old already because I think they released 20 years of madness as well, or 25 years of I don't know that they, they released one of those. So, but this one is then the older one, yeah. Okay, then we have Vader. I bought this one because it's it's different, it's different than like, like standard shirts, like you have like sleeve prints as well. And then, yeah, just the logo. You, you can wear it on a normal day out. Well, probably. Welcome to hell. <laughs> yeah, but awesome. With them, I kind of loved the first one and then slowly worse and worse and worse and worse. And, I don't know, for me. They're not bad, but it's just even when they played like an anniversary gig they played a bit from every album and I started from the old ones and went to the newer ones and the progression was worse 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 and at the end I was happy that it finished at the end <laughs> you know but that's maybe just me oh and this one yeah logo just the logo in front and on the back is the kill and that one I bought, yeah, I think I bought on a, on a gig when they went on tour with this album, so it's quite oldish as well. And, and I saw Corpse first, to, no, 1998, and since then I think I've seen them with every album release at least once. So yeah, Corpse is one of those. I think it could be that second place after after napalm or even more than napalm i don't know hard to say i've seen them both quite a bit right and then is monstrosity if not seen them not the greatest shirt is it feels a bit lazy you know somehow i don't know not the biggest fan of this design but yeah hard to get it because i love the band itself Nothing on the back on this one. Another band I love, and I love the album as well, I think. Yeah, Sinister Hate. Sinister is amazing. I had a chance to see them once live in a, on Hellfest, and it was really good, really good. And another logo. But this is one of my all-time favorite logos. You can say what you want, you know, like I know Mazurkevich said, yeah, they made the logo better. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. This is this is the best one. This might be of any logos my favorite one. Simple, brutal, you know, not overcomplicated, overcomplicated, readable, awesome. Then we move to Irish guys, Primordial, as well bought it, oh this, I didn't buy it on a gig, but I've seen them live a couple of times, and then, yeah, they're really good live, really good. 
again nothing on the back on this one but yeah it's like yeah it's full black metal something in between you know but like serious folk metal is not <laughs> yeah it's not like happy one then we go to soul demise life is just a moment just like death yeah just the death is permanent mostly and the life is temporary yeah pretty short oh yeah and now we have uh, the old shot the gore rotted you know remember the rotted was there so here's the gore rotted as well and uh, I like the back actually <laughs> it's amazing it's simple and amazing it doesn't have to be blood oil all over the place well it's, it's great <laughs> another great grind can't grind there isn't this just just brilliant design for a grind core this this is just perfect <laughs> You know when the guys are not taking them seriously, you know? It, it's amazing. I had to have it. Once I saw it, I was laughing for half an hour and then I had to buy it. It's awesome. They have another one I want to buy, but yeah, this was the most important one. Right, look at this beauty. Entombed. And the back. Rip Petrov, but amazing band, yeah. But you know all of it, so right. Then we move to something completely different, and it's a shirt from Czech band Arch of Hell. And uh, I started to listen to them. I, I actually pirated their their music in the beginning, so. Uh, I downloaded the first album and that intro of that first album is so amazing and intro on the first song is, is with violence together and everything and then the, the female voice of Teresa is, is absolutely awesome and uh, since then it, I have the Teresa as well as my friend on Facebook and I've chatted and everything and I bought it direct from them as well really really great guys and, and really awesome music Highly recommend to check them out, and they released the re-released the first album as well. And I have somewhere that that shirt from the first album as well. This is from the second one. Awesome band, awesome band. Right, another awesome band is is this one, Immortal. The seventh date of Blaster. Yeah, it's not the greatest. <laughs> Design, I would say, I don't know why they did it, but you know, I had a chance to get it, and I, so I got it. Immortal is great, right? Another sinus shirt, nothing on the back on this one, yeah. But yeah, like last couple of years, well, this year a bit less, but two years before. I was so on grindcore and all that what comes with it, you know, and so yeah, then I bought a lot of shirts from grind bands which I've heard for the first time at that point, but these are great, yeah. I still love the grindcore, so yeah. Oh, right, and I love these as well. Impaled Nazarene, I've seen them like a couple of times. Yeah, saw me Finland Perkele. Yeah, awesome. And a great shirt, great shirt. Great quality as well. So, like it. Okay, then the next one is Septic Death. This is quite tiny. I don't know, does it fit? I'll put it to side, maybe again this will go to my wife. It's a, it's a, it's a good now when I go through these, these shirts with you guys together. Uh, I can finally find something that doesn't fit me anymore, so it will go to my lads or to my missus, maybe, if they want, you know, if not they can wear it at the home, because I can't get into it, maybe. Right, 
another absolute gem this member isn't this beautiful Stockholm death metal and the colors and everything is so is so great it's really really great shirt love it all right then another band I absolutely adore is Asphyx Necrosaurus from the last album it is an amazing album probably my second favorite from them and, and no the rack is not my favorite my favorite is actually God Cries and that's one of those albums where who is, which is too short for me but every single song is, is, is a masterpiece I love from, from first to last and uh, that was funny as well, we were driving with my missus and, and like some Scottish hills I think or somewhere I don't remember probably in Scotland somewhere yeah, in hills with a car going up and uh, you know she's sitting on the outside next to that that fall down you know and uh, then this album from from Asphyx don't be afraid to die and she like <laughs> just look at her she's like sweating the hours eh? Right, completely different stuff, Running Wild, one of those bands who uh, 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 you have heard one song, you've heard all of it, but I like it, I, I like it, there is a mood at some point and you just, you can listen to one album after another, yeah, and they have a lot of them, um, but this is, this is a great shirt, yeah, really, really great. All right, another impaled Nazarene. Nothing on the back on this one. And this one is quite old as well. I don't remember when I got it. I think I was still living in Latvia when I got this one. Yeah, so it it is really old, I think. If I'm not mistaken. Right, then we've got a Sepultura European tour. Ninety one. Arise! Awesome! So what do they have? Do they? Because they played Riga at that as well. Uh, but it's not on the back as it's German, French. Yeah, well it's not Latvia on it, but they played in Latvia at that point. But sadly I was too small. So I didn't even listen to them at that point. I started to listen to them two years later only. So yeah, implore. Yeah, nice, nice, like, how do you say, dark looking shirt. Nothing on the back again. Well, yeah. Okay, quite a bit of shirts today. Then we moved to band I saw last Friday. Biogenesis. Yeah, and uh, I took my 12-year-old uh, with me on this one, so we were two of us going, and he loved it as well, and we met the guy, you know, so they played, and then somebody gave the stick to my lad as well, and uh, then I bought him shirt as well, uh, and uh, then I asked him, do you want to go home, or do you want to wait for them, and then, then have up photos, he wanted to wait and have photos with them, so it actually was was quite important, I think, gig for him. You know, one of those who he actually really liked, you know, and I think he will remember for a long time. Massacre. From Beyond. Awesome. <laughs> this one, I bought this one in, in, in Wacken Open Air. I don't remember which year. And it was oh, great. I bought it, put it on, and I went to watch a band. And somebody in the band was wearing the same shirt, <laughs> so that was cool. Right, then we moved to Obituary. Yeah, the end complete shirt. I don't think we need to introduce you to these guys. I've seen them as well quite a few times. And the first one I was a bit disappointed because they 
played on like a s smaller stage and, and Wacken had, they didn't play Don't Care so I was eh? How is that possible? But they, they're not doing that mistake anymore so... <laughs> right, another napalm so no surprise Smear campaign uh, and uh, this is I think my, my favorite album well, this is a tour shirt, so yeah. Ah, right, another vomitory. We had a vomitory. Yeah, and this is tour 2011. No end to suffering tour. Yeah, and then another one of vomitory shirts. This is as well quite small, but. Well, it's not that kind of small. It annoys me when the pits are too small, so the, the it hurts there, so I might chop the hair and stuff. Oh no, it's no point because I have one with chopped two farms as well somewhere. Yeah, nothing on the back on this one, but yeah, great design. Yeah, but I, I couldn't find vomitory shirts for ages, and then I found three of them on, on the Brutal Sword Festival. I had to buy them all. Yeah, so, and the last one is actually. A Nurburgring Deathfest shirt, and uh, yeah, I like the design. I got it actually in a in a, in a bundle when I bought it because I wouldn't be buying. I, I normally don't buy festival shirts, and well, there are some great bands wearing this festival. But to be honest, I didn't go to this festival myself, so it's just in a bundle. But yeah, it's there, so I can keep it. I can't wear it with pride that I've been there, but I have it, you know, so. Yeah, so that's it for this time, for this episode. And, so yeah, the next one is this one. There will be another, uh, again some beauties in it, you know, some really good stuff as, as always, you know. On top, at this point at least, is more like true. <laughs> so yeah, uh, okay guys, thanks for watching, Say thanks for subscribing, you know. Thanks for putting that like if you do, comment if you do, and let's see you in the next one. Amen. <laughs>